3 plus 3 gives us 6. And 3 times 6 equals 18. So 18 times 1 over 2, which equals 18 divided by 2. And 18 divided by 2 is just 9. Okay? So finally, 9 divided by this 9, which equals 1. Okay? But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, first we have to do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority, and we have to work from left to right. And the same applies to addition and subtraction. Okay? Here, in this expression, we have one division, one multiplication, application here and the one parenthesis and here we have also a multiplication okay because in mathematics when a number is placed next to parenthesis it means multiplication and we usually don't write the multiplication sign for brevity okay so we have one division two multiplications and the one parenthesis First, we have to do this parenthesis. And after this parenthesis, we must do this division, not this multiplication. If you do this multiplication before this division, it is wrong. Because multiplication and division have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. Okay, so first this parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have 3 plus 3, which gives us 6. So we have 9 divided by 3 times 6 and times 1 over 2. Now we have 1 division and the 2 multiplications. First we have to do this division because we have to work from left to right. 9 divided by 3 gives us 3. So 3 times 6 times 1 over 2. Now we do this multiplication. 3 times 6 gives us 18. And 18 times 1 over 2. Okay? And this is equal to 18 divided by 2, which gives us just 9. And this is our final answer to this problem. The correct answer is 9.